Do you know about those things again for tuning into yet another video? We are doing a unboxing of the TCMT 2023-2024 CVO saddlebags. So these are the ones with the 6x9 speaker lids. Um, so we'll see what's included. We got this on sale. Uh, eBay was doing a, a promotional discount, I believe 20%. So we got these for like 300 bucks, a little bit over $300. Uh, ordered them on Saturday or Friday and today's Wednesday. So it took about uh, three, th three to four days or yeah, three, three business days. So let's go ahead and open this up. Let's see what's inside. Um, you know, so a couple of things to know. Uh, Harley Davidson, I believe Harley Davidson has a VIN lock on the speaker uh, grills for these uh, saddlebags. So I'm not sure if you'll be able to purchase the speaker grills through Harley Davidson. TCMT, they actually have the speaker grills. You can buy them, they're $80. Uh, they also have a, uh, a new listing after I got these TCMT posted another list, a listing and those include the uh, speaker grills but they're like over 500 bucks so I'm not entirely sure why it's $500 if, if the lids are not you know that expensive I'm, I'm not entirely sure but uh, these do I believe these do not have the speaker grills we're gonna open this up like I said they, this kit does not have the speaker grill but I'm wondering if it has the keys or if it's got anything else I believe everything's included I believe I'm not entirely sure uh, the camera's in the way so we do have keys all right we have, we have three keys which is pretty neat uh, I did see somebody having some issues on a different on another set of saddlebags let's see there's a lot of padding in here there's a ton of padding which is always good so these are black these are vivid black saddlebags there's a ton of padding in here I was a little concerned about these saddlebags even from Harley Davidson because I've seen some of the reviews and yes they are light but that's because the the ABS is thinner and it's not as uh, it's 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 also flimsy compared to the uh, to the uh, to the uh, Mount uh, Rushmore uh, baggers. Let's go ahead, and pull one out. They are well packaged. A lot of padding. They're a little heavy, even though they're they're supposedly light or lighter than the the Rushmore. Uh, Bags. Let's go ahead and move the box and let's put the the bag on 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 the on the main box. All right, so we have the bag now on my little toolbox, and we're going to see what it looks like. We're, we're going to look for imperfections and stuff like that. We'll see what's included. I believe these are already assembled, so you guys can see the padding well packaged. There's no bubble wrap, but there's a ton of this foam uh, in there. And they're also in this uh, fiber uh, cloth thing, so they're pretty heavy. And there it is. There's the speaker lid. Wow, these are very nice. So let's see. Well, that finish is fantastic, guys. Look at that finish. Minor imperfections are already right there. I can see some imperfections. A couple scratches. I'm pretty sure you you could buff those out. All right, not a big deal. Uh, I got the black on black. So uh, they have different ones. They have a, a satin finish. They have a chrome finish. These are black with black. Imperfections. I see a scratch right there. Not a big deal. Uh, let's see, we have to keep on looking at these. There is a little bit of a drip right over here. Let me see if I put it in camera. Right there, just a little drip from the, the clear coat, of course. You see it right there. I mean, minor stuff, guys. I mean, these were, uh, I believe, three, 330 bucks with uh, tax. So, man, these are very nice. 
let's go ahead even the uh the opening the the latch is also a, a, a painted finished black you guys can see i'm not sure what these are for i think this is for the uh the wires so all the cuts are already done let's go ahead and open it up so It's, I'm guessing it's like quarter inch thick ABS. It is raw ABS. So avoid using uh, Loctite around this. If you use Loctite, it will uh, eat away the plastic. I know because it, it's happened to me before. You do have all the seal. You have the speaker wire itself already in there too as well. Look at that. That's really neat. Uh, These are just like the uh, the CVOs, like the 2024. Everything's already included. A lot of plastic everywhere. Um, you know, the light. You can see all the latching mechanism and stuff like that. It's all right there. Uh, it's got like some kind of a grease, a little bit, a little bit of residue of some sort. The weather stripping is all in there. You have your um, your latching system everything's already in, uh, installed and included which is really you know neat it's really nice uh, there seems to be a little bit of rust on this just a you know just a bit of rust these look pretty neat guys so that's the inside of the saddlebag these supposedly fit a little bit more because of how much wide they get around this area so that's that is this how do you close these oh we had a wire to the other side what is going on here oh we got a match up oh the thing's open all right so that's that okay uh you know any other imperfections i don't see anything else i mean the backs look fantastic look great minor minor you know orange peel just minor but the surface the finish is fantastic so if you have a vivid black i mean you're pretty much set if you have a vivid black harley davidson and you want to update to the um to the new uh, chopped bags that harley davidson has these look great uh, these will fit with your uh, luggage rack or your saddlebag uh, mounting system. If you guys see those videos, they, they mount up exactly the same. So the only thing that's really changed is the shape uh, and uh, the, the, the shape, the chopped rear, this little design stuff right here as well. And of course, the top. So like I mentioned about the speaker lids, the grills, the speaker grill on these ones, um, I believe Harley Davidson has a Vinlock. I've been trying to probably order them. Uh, if you're buying them from Harley, you would have to get the part number. I had the part number, I'm not sure, but uh, you could probably order them through Harley, but I'm pretty certain they're going to want a VIN number. So, this is the left side saddlebag. Fantastic. I'm really digging the overall look to it. Let's go ahead and grab the scale, see how much this thing weighs. All right, so we have the scale zeroed out. Let's see how much the saddlebag weighs. So this is with the lid, all the uh, stuff as far as getting it, uh, just the overall weight of the saddlebag. Everything is included. Let's see how much this thing weighs. And it weighs in at 12 pounds, two ounces. So it's just, just a hair over 12 pounds. That's pretty light my uh my saddlebags from viking the xl viper saddlebags i believe they weigh in about that much so like i mentioned this this isn't including the hardware the hard the hardware could probably weigh in a couple extra pounds so this potentially could weigh in about 14 pounds which is pretty light um you know that's that's pretty light and of course this is because Harley Davidson's using, I believe Harley Davidson's using this, the same thickness of this ABS. 
Typically, TCMT has, uh, you know, lighter components compared to the Harley Davidson. I do have the Harley Davidson Mount Rushmore saddlebags, but they're stored away. I guess I could have, I mean, I mean, I guess I could have opened that up, but you know what? Uh, so I've seen somebody else already has that video, and, and they are, I believe, a couple of pounds lighter than the uh, the, the, the uh, Mountain Rushmore. The 2014 to 2023 or 2024, if you still have the limiteds, because they're, they're still using the same bags. So 12 pounds is, is pretty light. Uh, my Leather Pros, they weigh in at 20 pounds. So Leather Pros are quick detach. You could also put more stuff in them. They're flexible. Uh, the reason why I'm switching over to these is because I want something to paint, you know. So I am doing a, a different build. Currently, I'm still painting stuff. So we'll see uh, when I'll get around to painting these. I'm, I'm going to be rocking the uh, the Leather Pros for a little bit with this new paint set that I'm doing. So uh, I'm pretty excited about this. And like I mentioned, I still have to order the uh, the grills. So I'm still at the, I still have to order these. They're $80 right now, like I said, even through TCMT. So I'm not sure if I should wait, see if the price will drop, because I'm pretty sure they probably will drop. But uh, they're $80, even through Harley Davidson, they're also $80. If you have the CVO VIN, uh, you know, buying the the 6x9s from Harley, you're paying about 300 bucks, and that includes the uh, the speaker grill. So we'll see what happens. I'll probably just I'll probably just have to bite the bullet and and get the uh, the speaker grills because you know looking at it, the speaker grills are eighty bucks. The speaker lids, the five by sevens, they're about the same price. <laughs> so you know Hardy Davidson, I'm pretty sure they they do have a patent on this. So you would have to of course get it through Harley or you know get it and or pay the the price that they are so right now because it's they're still new nobody is going to have these speaker grills until probably about a year or two from now then you'll, you'll see the price of the speaker grills drop as you know as more people start to make their own uh their their, their own product so there's the inside raw abs on the inside like most of the time i say quarter inch thick uh abs which is pretty good you know i'm not gonna uh, you know complain about that Because I'm, I'm almost certain Hardy Davidson is using the same ABS material to keep the saddlebags light because they were able to chop down quite a bit of weight You guys want to see the other one? Let's go ahead and uh, pull the other saddlebag out. Let's see if there's any imperfections on that one Like I said, you have a minor drip on this side You're not gonna notice it because I mean the, the saddlebags sit a lot lower. I mean I've, already, I've mentioned this before you're not going to be able to notice that not from when it's mounted when it's mounted onto the bag it's like probably about two feet off the ground so this is even lower than that so for someone to really notice this little drip you have to be like down here you have to be like oh look at that there's a drip and he, and he, you would have to be on fours on all fours so you can notice that drip so minor little imperfection like i said so there it is right there man this finish is just fantastic minor like there's minor orange peel, but I, I think it matches the OEM. So this one, is there any drips? No, this one's actually a lot better. Man, I'm just impressed on how good these saddlebags look for <laughs> for 300 bucks. Look at that, guys. That's beautiful. That looks that looks fantastic. Same thing, latching system. Oh, this one has some goodies in it. So let's go ahead and turn it around. Let's see what's included in this one. So the way it opens, of course. Oh, there's no rust on this one. On this, on on this over here, there's no rust, like on the other one. This was something that I noticed on the Million Dollar Bogan video. The fellow was complaining about how flimsy the saddlebags are, and that's what that was with the CVO. You can see how it kind of moves. But of course, you also have the uh, the uh, the, the speakers and all, and all this other stuff. And you also have to remember that this ABS is a lot thinner. And you know, Harley Davidson, 
I believe Harley Davidson kind of made them a little bit too light. I would rather have the thicker ABS and the extra weight, but I don't know. You guys can let me know in the comments. Do you guys rather have a lighter saddlebag, save about four pounds, but then have this sort of stuff? Because that's that was just something that the other guy was complaining about. So you have some bags here. I'm not sure what these are for. These are these are these are not that big. Uh, you have the wires, of course. You guys can see. You have the wires. This connects. You have some quick connectors. That's pretty neat because now the saddlebags will be sealed from the from uh, you know from from weather conditions and uh, you know dirt, debris, dust. So it's neat that they included these so you could just hook up the wires. Uh, how, how come it's got so many wires? Well, I mean, technically you only need two, right? Yeah, there's only two wires here. There's only two wires here, but how come you have so many wires here? Are, are these, can you, can you mount or can you wire other stuff? Yeah, you have your, your ground and your power for some reason. And then these are your speaker wires. So I'm not entirely sure. How come you need four wires? Maybe somebody in the comments can tell me what, what that's for. So you have your wires, which is neat. Weather sealed, they have the sleeving in there. I'm not sure what this is. Let's go ahead and close the, the lid here. So you can see same thing, raw ABS. I'd say it's about a quarter inch thick. Uh, you know, good looking saddlebag all the way around. Let's go ahead and close that. And then that latch is in there very easy. Like I mentioned, you have uh, these, these connectors. And then I guess you put them in there and then you twist and they lock into place. So, what do we have in here? What is this? I guess these are for your speaker lids, for the speakers. Okay, so when you're washing the bike, I guess you could put these on there so you don't get your speakers wet. So you have a little sh shower cap for the lids. I've seen that on the other ones, of course. So that's what's included. You have the shower cap, you have uh, the keys, you have three keys, you have the wires, and then you also have, uh, you have three keys. Three keys, you don't have the mounting system. So that should be on your bike or you can order it through TCMT and they have it for like 40 bucks. Let's go ahead and put this back in there. You guys want me to weigh this? It's gonna weigh the same, it's 12 pounds. It's the same thing. I'm not sure why this is like that though. Let's grab one of these. Just you know, kind of see real quick. So this oh this mounts on the inside. Not on, on the outside. So and I guess this is what connects on the inside. What but you already have speaker wires over here. You have these speaker wires. I don't know where these go to. I don't see them over here. Huh. There's no instructions on this. So you do have speaker wires. I guess that would connect there. And then I guess these go on the inside. Uh, you do have a wire. You, you do have an opening over here. Go to the side over there. Hmm. I don't know where these connect. Anyways, no instructions on them. All right. You, uh, you know, not entirely sure. But bags look fantastic. The finish looks great. I'm gonna end up painting them anyways. So, uh, you know, as far as imperfections, I don't see any. The bags look fantastic, man. Look, I'm, I'm really impressed on how good these look. So that's pretty much it. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching yet another video. You guys could buy this one or you guys could buy the ones with the speaker grills. Avoid having, you know, just get everything all together. Um, 
so far right now if I order the speaker grills that they could be a month because where they're being shipped from so thanks for tuning in Lysa Risk, please leave a like on the video be much appreciated guys uh, if you want to subscribe see how the build is going I'm gonna start uploading some videos I am currently helping out the wife with the newborn I just had uh, I just had another kid so beautiful little girl healthy you know just blessed all the way around so uh, let's just check the box one more time and see if there's anything else in there because there's a ton of padding all right i checked the box that looks about it so that's what's everything's included you can buy this i believe right now they're 400 dollars again you can wait for a discount kind of like what i did from ebay it was ride what is it? ride deals 15 or something like that right no ride parts deal or something like that it was a discount but unfortunately it's already over because it was only good until september uh we are now in october so uh you could always of course make offers stuff like that tcmt they're located here in california uh, pretty pretty good uh company if you ask me i have a lot i have a ton of their parts on my bike so thanks for watching thanks for tuning in life's risk get out there and ride later